What's the other 47 model trains? 48 model trains. Hey everyone. Uh, welcome back to the channel once again. And welcome to another episode of Model Trains. So today we have an unboxing video after like, I don't know, a couple of months ago. Anywho, point is, I got a new engine. I, I'm so excited. This is my first ever, well, okay, not, wait. First one that works because there is one little guy over there in the, in the corner. Can you see him? I think you can, yeah, there you go. Yeah, yeah that little guy gave me problems, but now we got a replacement for it. So let's just go up, up ahead and open this. So I found this literally like a couple, a couple of days ago, like on eBay, just randomly and Basically, I saw this for the price it was going, which is not bad. Uh, got this for it was I it was it was a bit. I was I don't even know how. I was the only one who managed to like bid on it, and it went for I say a, a really good price. So sixty bucks it went for. Usually these go for what, like hundred fifty bucks now because well Niagara's are just uh, coming along now and they usually go up for high price. So there's that and yes, we're in. All right, then move the paper. Ooh, can you guys see that? Yeah. Um, so let's just get this out. And there we go. Oh God, oh, okay, everything just... Okay, hold on a second. <laughs> this is just a giant mess and bubble wrap. I might keep the bubble wrap, because this can be used for keeping models and such. So I might, I might keep this. So, yeah, okay. <clears throat> Now back to the main thing. It's ball wrap, very nice, and in the box. Oh yeah, this came with the original box and everything. I should mention that. But here we go. Wow. Here it is. The Bachman New York Central Niagara in the famous NYC scheme. I think it's. I don't, I'm not. Okay, so apologies for this. I am not a good or it's or knowledgeable man on new york central you know a few other engines and such i don't know livery wise because i'm over a fancy fan yes i know ironic but uh this is a very nice name livery um oh just read it's one of the bogeys uh came off it's in there i saw it just now so let's just take this and open this all right then let's just open this here and oh, what's that oh that's that's, that's just cardboard okay uh it's not double okay it's not like a taiko package where the, there's like a huge space you just be careful because i do not want to break this this, this was a very delicate and very marked fine okay let me just okay uh man this is this is a mess here jesus all right so just put everything away and take the foam off the tripod and just put the Niagara in, in a way safer space. Okay, there we go. There it is. Wow. This is amazing. Let's just take your tender first. Okay. This is just three hard. Okay, there we go. Okay, so here's the tender. Uh, horn hook cobbler. I just realized that. Uh, it's no big deal. Uh, all plastic wheels though, which is a shame. I would prefer metal wheels because plastic wheels they do break uh, not, not break, but they over time get un uneven and they leave uh, pieces of their wheels on their tracks So there's that but not a big deal um, and, the tr and even heck even the wheels some of these don't even look half bad They look like they have no road sign on this. Wow. Okay. Let's just really put that Okay, some of the tracks, and then let's take the Niagara out. Okay, hold on, give me a second. All right, so I took it out of the box and put the trading trucks on, and wow, this thing is beautiful. That Those smoke deflectors, everything's just so nice. You just realized that, okay, there you go, now it's down. Wow, it's just amazing. So let me just put this on the track, and let's test it. I move the tender forward, just... I let the poor guy over, Jesus. Ah. Okay, so we just sit down properly and get my trusty wooden house to be. There we go. All right, so just put the engine on the tracks and and the wheels, but the wheels don't want to go. Okay, let's put the tender in and then let's put, there we go, okay. So engine and tender are connected and let's just begin this. 
So the setter did say that this thing runs and I'm trusting that. And thankfully it's not like my other Niagara where the wheels are like, the gears are broken. Cause that's why I couldn't fix it anymore cause the gears just broke all, all of them. All four actually broke. So hopefully this one runs, please. Okay, put half power and I don't see. Oh, oh, whoa, I just saw something shy bright. I did not know what that was. Oh. Oh God, okay. Come on, let me show you guys. So, look at this. I put power. Yeah, the, the, this light dampens. I think there's a short circuit going on. That's, is that smoke? No, I think I'm gonna, I don't want. I don't know. Okay, whoa. Okay, I keep hearing like a, like a, I think that's the motor making this noise, but I don't know. Oh God, please tell me this, this panel doesn't have problems too. Oh, I hear it. Oh, no, it doesn't have a short circuit. I think, I heard the motor. I swear I just hold, I just, It's those, there's none a short circuit. I don't know how that just disappeared, but no, it won't move. Uh, oh, oh, okay, no, no, no. That was just me, sorry. I, I, I swore I saw I got sparks, but that was just me. Uh, that's weird. Sometimes putting it in the other direction helps. Let's see. Huh, that's strange. Okay. Uh, huh. Well, I mean, the gears are not broken, so that's that's a good thing. I wonder if it's, huh. I'll be back to you guys in a moment. Okay, so on further inspection, I just realized that the wheels are really, really dirty. Um, so I need to clean those up and maybe that's the problem because, man, that is not looking good. I'll, I'm gonna clean those and see that maybe that's part of the problem, I don't know. Also, I just realized that the chassis seems to not be connected properly because when I, because it falls forward a bit. I don't know if you can see that, but. Okay, yeah, then you just clean the wheels. So I cleaned the wheels and they were very, very dirty but it's still nothing, like no signs. I heard the, mer the motor, so that was a good thing, but it doesn't wanna like start up or anything like that. I don't know what's really going on. Oh boy. Two Niagara's and both gave me trouble, so this is just, this is just incredible. It's just my luck, ain't it? Uh, okay, I'm gonna try to find out what's the problem with this. Okay, so I took it apart and would you know it, it's also a split chassis Niagara. Not only do the both are not working, but they're both split chassis. This is just, this is just my life. Like, why, why do you do this, both of you? Oh my God. Well, anyways, uh, took it apart and I applied right now full, full, full throttle, um, I don't know. And nothing is still moving. It's nothing. Just no. Nothing. Oh Jesus Christ. What was that? Okay. Um I'm not gonna touch with metal parts anymore. Um <sighs> Okay, yeah, uh, I just realized I'm using metal parts on a thing that's conducting electricity. Why didn't I think of that? Oh, Jesus Christ, I'm just so dumb. Okay, um, nothing, okay. I'm gonna try and figure out what's even wrong with this thing. Okay, so nothing yet, unfortunately, but I just got an idea. I'm gonna try and see if maybe the original body, okay, there's no, oh yeah. The original body, aka this part of, of my original Niagara fits on this because if that's the case, I think we might have a uh, working Niagara because I just realized this. So let me put my parts 
my heart stingy back here. Okay, so um, my original, this is my Niagara original Niagara's motor, right? And it does run. I tested it, and it does run. And I just realized that I think it's probably the same like shell. I think maybe. So I think I could combine parts from both and maybe make like one Super Niagara or something like that. Um, so I'm gonna try and see if I could do that. Um, but I'll do that later because this video is like already way too freaking long. So yeah, I just put the show back on. So thank you for watching today's unboxing video, and I'll. Um, Probably make a video once I repair this. So yeah, there's that. Thank you all for watching. See you guys in the next one. Yippee.